Today, the first basic therapy is daratuma with bortezomib, the VCD combination, dara VCD. However, some patients will relapse. In cases that where uh, chemotherapy or transplantation, at always transplantation is not an option, and for most patients is not an option, we have to consider other treatments. For patients with AL amyloidosis who do have T1114 translocation in their plasma cells, the use of venetoclax-based regimen seems to be a very active therapy, rapidly acting and also inducing deep responses. For patients who do not have T1114 translocation, venetoclax is probably not an option. So for these patients, we can either consider if they have not received daratumab to give a daratumab-based regimen, uh, regimens that contain lenalidomide or preferably pomalidomide is an acceptable and good option. We have some additional new options. For example, we have a clinical trial in which belantamab mafodotin is given in such patients. We have good results even in patients who have been exposed or are refractory to daratumumab. We expect to have some data in the near future with uh, uh, bispecific antibodies. And there are some preliminary data in maybe eight or 10 patients with CAR T cells treated in Israel with an anti BCMA uh, uh, CAR T cell constructed in uh, Hadassah uh, in uh, Jerusalem.